Hey what's up guys and welcome back to another video. We hope you are doing great and this is the new Creality Ender 3 S1 full review. Here is everything included in the box. Manuals and tools, cable, filament holder, screen holder, the printer itself, new upgraded screen, Creality 24 volts 15 amps power supply. In this printer we can also find a 32-bit motherboard that is also one of the upgrades that Creality made in the last year. We will add a link to our blog in the description if you want to learn more about it. Dual Z-axis upgrade, besides the two, instead of one Z-axis motor, we can also find a pulley and timing belt. This way the print will be even more precise and extruder can move Z-axis evenly. Filament sensor was also added to this printer, so when your filament runs out during print, it will give us a chance to save it. And the most important upgrade of them all, new direct drive extruder. It was beautifully designed with unique double gear extrusion mechanism, ensuring smooth fitting and is compatible with wider range of materials, flexibles and abrasive materials. Overall printer is very fast and easy to assembly, now we just have to level it and we are ready for some test prints. Creality also upgraded bed leveling sensor and made CR touch with a metal probe which is more stable and greatly prolongs its service life. It comes with new upgraded PEI magnetic bit plate with high strength and heat resistance. It's compatible with PLA, PETG, flexible, ABS, even PIC and other 3D filaments. Ok, these were some test prints we did with different materials. We tested of course PLA, silk, PTG, different flexible materials and these are the results. This printer has a little bit bigger build volume than previous Ender 3 versions, so it can print 220 by 220 by 270 mm. We will start with the most commonly used materials like PLA, PETG and silk. The printer did a pretty good job, we printed everything with speed 80 mm per second and print quality of 0.16, the level of details is just breathtaking. It does take a little bit more time to print though. By far the most exciting upgrade on this printer is of course direct drive extruder. So having a printer that can print flexible filaments at such high speed and quality is a huge success. Printing at a speed 25 mm per second we tested two different harnesses that we produce. 85 Ashore and 98 Ashore and the printer did a fantastic job. To end what is the most striking about this printer is that it has a new direct drive double traction full metal extruder with a new very powerful hot end design which will allow us to print many more different types of filament with higher quality. We really do hope you found this review helpful, that was our aim. Check out also brand new Creality CR10 Smart Pro 3D printer with full metal direct drive extruder, Creality Cloud app that allows you to manage 3D printer anytime and anywhere, dual mode leveling that provides great looking first layer, real time HD camera and much more. Those are some big big news from Creality. Anyways, thank you for watching, please like this video and subscribe and we will see you in the next one. Bye!